Hey guys, Troy from the Do It Yourself World Electronics, and I have here what's called an earth battery. Literally, I am pulling electricity out of the earth. And what I have here is an iron nail and a copper piece of copper wire, thick copper wire, which I drove into the ground. And I'm pulling out 0.45 volts, so almost half a volt out of the earth. Now, you can experiment with distances and different metals and locations of metal. So as you can see here, I've got, there's a nail here, which I've got for a different experiment. Piece of copper pipe, nail, wire, nail, wire. And I can experimentally move the lead, if, obviously if I take it off, there's no voltage, up to a different nail farther away. And I'm still getting the same voltage, almost half a volt. Let's go even farther away and let's see what we get here. A little bit less, 0.38. So definitely closer is better. Now, here we are back to 0.45 volts. Nothing exciting, you can't do a lot with that in an individual battery and there's not a lot of current, but it shows a idea that you can generate energy with just the earth in two different metals connected. Now there is some theory whether north or south orientation matters. So let's take this nail out and put it uh, north of the copper. And no, it's moving around. I think that it has to stabilize the energy between whatever's going on here has to stabilize because it's still moving around. Whereas once you've had them set down and you dra you uh, connect your meter, it seems to be pretty much the same. It looks like, well, it's still going up. I don't know why that is. Let's bring this closer in here and see what happens. See, I pull it out and we've got no electricity. I put it in here a little bit closer and see what we get. fluctuating a little bit and rising now if I take this off and put copper to copper I probably get nothing yeah a tiny tiny bit negative voltage but let's take this up further and go on to this lead so I've got the copper one here and this one there and we got 0.45 volts again but if we go down with this uh, north-south uh, we get a little bit less. And it's still going up. It's odd how those are, are changing. But anyway, there's the idea. If you put a lead, if you put a nail in the ground and put a piece of copper in the ground and connect the leads, you will get a voltage from the earth. Now, in the future, I will make a video taking separate containers and setting these up in series and see if we can do work with an earth battery for example lighting an led or charging a device so stay tuned for more exciting experiments and projects on the do-it-yourself world electronics and there's an earth battery for you guys free energy from the earth talk to you later